Okay, it's recording. That's the track piece you want to build first. Now we use the ruler to customize your track piece. Place the ruler in the rectangle. And drag the yellow button to adjust the track, like this. Place your slide the button up or down to adjust. Ready to test, Crash? Crash is ready to go. You're going too slow. Well, we didn't get to speed it. We just get to speed it. I know. Too slow. Pick up the knob. Place the knob and the turn the knob to make the coaster go faster. <laughs> you can press the test button to test your changes. 122. Um, we don't have enough energy. <laughs> you killed him. Too fast. Turn the knob till it's in the green. You have to leave it in the zone. There. Test. All right. Now, pick your second track piece. That one's really cool. Got a cork screw. The cobra roll. Now there's two rectangles to put the ruler in. Where's the thing? Oh. This will be the highest we can. Yep. 210 feet. What about the other one? You can adjust the speed now, too. Mm -hmm. Rass will test your changes when you press the test button. There. So you can go forward a little bit there. See if it will work. <laughs> Look at that! Great! Pick your third track piece. The zero roll, gravity roll is awesome. <laughs> we'll go wildest for everything. All the way to the top, bro. 250 feet high. Time to wrap things up, engineers. One more. There. That means six miles per hour. Great job. Now that you've calibrated the system, you can set aside the tools. All you need to do is pick your track pieces. Okay. Pick your final track piece. The hammerhead. Your roller coaster track is complete. <laughs> Get it? Look at that. This design goes upside down. 